And we're back, fellow knife and outdoor gear enthusiast. See ya. Jewel, just Jewel. Another rousing AK blade episode that I'm sure you're going to love. Rousing, hey? Rousing. Lots of new blades from brands like QSP. Fosti. Kaiser. Spartan Blades. Bradford USA. And Kershaw. So unlike the government, we're going to get right down to business. We're going to start with the... Fosti Corgi. Yep. So it's a Trek Lock. My favorite. Yep. Knife has been on nine different varieties. 48 short of Heinz. They're catching up, but... We only got two in stock right now. Some of them sold out. Yeah. Got the green and brass, which was one we have here, mm -hmm. right? And uh, let's see. We'll tell you how long it is. Pocket knife a 7.17 inch when fully opened. Has a 2.99, which is almost three. Drop point 14C 28N blade. At least on this option. There's another with a uh, what nitro V. Mm -hmm. Finishes vary from blackstone wash to. This stone wash. Each has a flat grind, plain edge, comes with about 5861 on the HRC scale. Blade thickness is 0 0.118 inches and is deployed with either the front flipper or the back flipper. I reversed those, but there it is. I know. Yep. Symmetrical flipper tabs. Operates on cage ceramic ball bearing system. Handles are micarta. Yep. Though there are options G10 and copper. Some offer brass and copper or other G10 accents. Each knife has a tip-up stainless pocket clip, recessed lanyard hole, and a button for blade disengagement. So you can be like the former Queen of England. R.I.P. Procure a fleet of Corgis starting at just $59. You poured some out for her homies and I My gave it to My royal homegirl. Yeah. Yeah. $59 from landknife.com. All right, I'm liking the Corgi. Corgi's my style. It's got the dual purpose of front flipper, which I can't stand, and regular flipper, which in this, with the nice block there, a regular, normal human being can flip it open very wow. easily. Wow. And I like that. Believe it or not, I like this design thing right here. I don't know. Something about it says... Buy me. Yeah, futuristic. I don't know. I just like it. I think it's very nice. I imagine it works extremely well. I have not tried one of these. And I like the little uh, at the bottom of the spacer. That's great. So I like this blade from Vosti too. No way. I have seen the mixed material thing before, especially from Kaiser, but I really think this design is better. Sorry, Kaiser. I like the roundedness. Um, I think it's a perfect everyday carry for any Joe, um, you know. Joe, you know, okay, I could see myself or anyone else flipping this open, you know, classy dinner knife or a walk about the town. And you get a cleaning cloth, stickers, patch, no pouch or tin again, so A minus. Mm. Yes, sometimes I hold grudges. Okay, anything else to say? You went Mick, Mick Dundee on us there. Yep. Where are you going? Walk about. Yep, with that, we're on to the QSP Penguin Slip Joint. Just when you thought couldn't milk the penguin any longer. Yeah. I didn't even know penguins could be milked, did you? <laughs> you can on. milk anything with teats. teats. Awesome. Come on. I set you up for that one. Yes. Put it on a tea and gave you the driver. That's great. Yeah, so you have to admire QSP for that, you know. At this point, it probably makes up like 90% of their inventory. Mm -hmm. So this new model comes in 10 options, all of which are amazing, though I may be a little biased. There's the jungle fat carbon fiber, nebula carbon fiber, storm carbon fiber, and four different colors of G10. We're showcasing the storm carbon fiber option today. Yep. Anyways, this folder is 7.08 inches when open and has a 3.02 inch CPM 20 CV steel sheep's foot blade. With either the stone wash or black stone wash, we have a stone wash one. Thickness of the blade is 0.118 inch thick and comes to about 59.61 on the HRC. Operating on the copper washer, blade is open manually with faux fuller. It's also got that half stop, guys. Wow. Yep. Lastly, it has a lanyard hole. And can be obtained from landknife.com starting at only 6280. Of course, the G10 option supports 14C 28 in instead of 20 CV. But that's still a quality cutting steel. And you can pick from amazing handle options. Now, 
This has got a great choil. Oh, she took my choil. Sorry. Now, I'm a big fan. I'm not a big fan of the slip joint, but I'm a big fan of the penguin itself. So I might just have to get one slip joint just to have every type of penguin that there is. Mm. You know what I mean? And I believe this is the only penguin to come in storm carbon fiber and jungle wear carbon fiber. So it's only going to be the only one right now, although you mm. never know. I can come out with more, but for right now, it's the only one that comes into it. So that's nice. So see, what do you think? Well, I might have to check out one that has 20 CV steel. That one is 20 um, CV steel. I think that I, I might get one of these. And I already have oh, I was gonna test a QSP it. slip joint. I have a worker, which I really like. Not a penguin, um, though. Not a penguin. I might get one of these. In the storm? Is there another? There's a black blade storm. Is there another? Uh, Jungle. Wind. Yeah, I might try one of these. I kind of like the There's a nebula. nebula. nebula one. Yeah. yeah, we'll see. Okay, go ahead. All right, do I have to? Yes. All right. Got the latest Kershaw Auto Launch 8. It's on the table. Well, it's not no more. New option, of course, which you guys know we do sometimes. The Kershaw 8 is comes in three options now. Wow. Yeah. We have the new gray one. This one is my favorite out of the entire series. Is it really? Yep. 2.3 two, two ounces. So light. Go ahead. All right. When deployed, it's 8.25 inch and sports a 3.5 inch CPM 154 Stiletto or Spear Point style blade, which is now offered in regular stone wash finish. Yes. 0.121 thick. The blade is ready for use via the button. Bam. Did you hear that? Nice. She nicked it off the table, too. There it is again. There you go. Has a gray 6061 T6 aluminum handle. It's like calling you for dinner. Is it? Yep. Ting. I gotta get going, guys. Black carbon fiber insert, as well as a tip up reversible pocket clip. Yes, I know. It's mm -hmm. amazing. So you can get the new Made in the USA Kershaw Auto Launch 8 for $119.85 from mm. LandKnife.com. So not bad in price. It lies between the other two models, the Damascus and the original. Um, I do like the gray one more. I think it helps the carbon fiber stand out better. I like that they didn't mess with the integrated finger guards or the size. It's all good. I would have liked just a little bit of texturing on the um, the aluminum. It's just a little slick. Just a little. Mm -hmm. But other than that, it's a solid pick for <clears throat> an auto. And the price is alright considering what it is and who makes it. I bet she gives it an A. It's... It, Give it an A. Yeah, All right. it's an A. So, what do you think? I am. I really can't say a whole lot more than you just did. Um, we've seen the design before, obviously, but man, I tell you, it's hard to believe sometimes that Kershaw makes these because when you handle their regular pocket knives and then you handle these, you just think to yourself, wow, these are so nice. Yeah, but then you handle ZTs too, and those are really nice. Yeah, ZTs are really nice, the but they're one. upper echelon in pricing nowadays. Well, that's so true. They're, uh, a little higher. But I like them because I'm a big knife person, and ZTs are normally always big, except for the Gideon, which doesn't even count. It's great. It doesn't even count. Not the Gideon no doesn't even count. Okay. I got a ZT display, and I wouldn't put it in there. Ouch. Burn. All right, so we're moving on, hitting the Bradford USA Guardian 3.2. So I see QSP isn't the only one milking designs this year. Hey. So this new model from Bradford is available in seven options. Seven options. Nice. That means seven lovely sheaths. We have the black smooth Micarta one on the table today. So it's 7.13 inch overall with three and a half inch AEB L blade with plain edge jumping and stone wash finish. Handle scales range from black Micarta to natural Micarta and even some textured pattern Micarta. Just varieties of Macarta. Yes, I know. Lovely. Lastly, the Full Tang USA Made Blade comes with a leather belt sheath for horizontal carry and a lanyard hole. They make a nice sheath, I'll tell you that. They do make a nice sheath. Mm -hmm. It also comes with a sticker, just so you guys know. Can't beat that. Find it at landknife.com for... $126.95. Yep. Okay. Go I'm ahead. a fan of Guardians. Now, you can't really say a whole lot because... Uh, it's a pretty simple design. You've had the, yeah, Guardians have been around forever. And a lot of them are very similar. And this one has a few little uh, basic differences, but not many. It's a nice uh, smaller a knife, blade, which I do not yeah. normally carry. I like a larger knife, especially because you know I can use it for multiple things, and I won't cut myself. There you are. <laughs> Funny enough, we never lose our luggage. <laughs> okay, so I 
feel it's about any consolation. I forgot my reading glasses. That's great. I feel about this the way I feel about all the other Bradford Guardians. It's quality fixed blade, nice standard options, USA made, nice leather sheath. It smells good, doesn't it? Yes, I like the leather. It's nice. All right, she gave it an A again. It means we've reached the half time. Yep, and luckily there won't be any pregnant half naked singers. Luckily. But there will be some Atlanta knife shameless plugs, so make sure to like, share, comment, and subscribe, as well as ring a ding ding that bell. That way you're linked with Atlantic Knives. There it is. Channel and get first look at any new content. There you go. You can also uh, you also get automatically entered in the giveaways. This is not your day. Which is fairly important. We have the formidable fixed blade giveaway. If it's my day, I get this Hasbro. It's taking place this month. Get your bid in here on this video or double your chances by becoming an official AK member. Do that and you'll be entered to win the top SAS boat, double edge knife, the Spartan Blades, ah, la, 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 and Jason Perry's model. All USA made blades and ready to go home with one lucky AK representative. AK representative? Did I say representative? It was just AK. I said member, didn't I? No. Oh, didn't. I thought I said member. Representative! <laughs> the link to become an official AK member is down below of course. and not in Australia. That's just good. Okay, of course there are other perks to becoming an official AK member. You get first access to new products, notified of deals, popular restock models too, discounts, and more. You never know what's possible if you enter the formidable fixed blade. You also get the SNC extra knives that you're not really interested anymore. That's great. We'd also like to take to this time to let you know about some of the more of the AK deals that are going on. Going We're on. still having our inventory blowout sale, which includes uh, models that you have your eye on from some time. We know. Got a wish list. You know. And lowest prices you have ever. And the rock means ever. Yep. Seen. Yep. So you can shop discontinued models from Civivi, Wii, Sencut, Cansep, Real Steel, Will, Steel Will, Artisan, and now Best Tech. So you guys putting your hands in the air like mm -hmm. you don't care. Yep. Even some of Best Tech's high dollar blades are on sale. Also, Baron Forge, Kershaw, and CRKT are on there also. Oh my goodness. PMP, Patriot Blade Works. There's probably more. So mm. much more. Just check it out on the All website. right. Go ahead. Take a big breath. Reset your breathing. And now back to a regular schedule. With that, we're back to the table looking at the Spartan Blades Poros. Or Porous. Mm. Poros or Porous? I don't think it really matters. Yeah. People somebody, call, call, somebody call it what you out. want. Been out a couple of weeks, but we've been out of stock until now. Comes in three options, black, green, and black G10 carbon fiber mix. So we have the two black options to show you guys today. So this folder is nine inches when the 3.75 inch 154cm steel drop point blade is deployed with the robust, and I say robust, full size back flipper tab. I know. So it also has the black titanium nitride coating is 0.125 inches thick and comes to 5860 on the HRC scale. Also features a plain edge. This is the carbon fiber one. Wow. Yep. Handle scales in this line lock are either OD Green G10, Black G10, or a mixture of Black G10 and carbon fiber. Stainless steel hardware, including screws, tip up, low profile, deep carry, reversible pocket clip, and pivot cap cover. All have a black electro deposit powder coating. Crazy. Yep. Lastly, Designed by Curtis Ayovioto. These liner locks weigh just 5.28 ounces. Probably just made some guy Italian that's not Italian, but he could be. Mm -hmm. Get stuff done with the Spartan Blades Poros for just $124.85 from AtlanticKnife.com. There's a ding. Yeah, so I'm going to go first. I like it. The only thing is nothing really like stands out for me. I mean, it's a solid knife, good quality. I just think at this level... You're competing with a lot of other companies and a lot of other designs and a lot of other knives. And nothing about this makes me think, I gotta have it. it it's nice. It works well, closes well, but nothing, you know, screams at me. Hmm. What do you think? I think it's too much knife for you. Oh, that must be All it. right, so here's what screams at me. The choil is usable. Oh, yeah. I really like that. doesn't have top jimping, but that's okay. I'll live. It is a good size uh, folding knife. <laughs> <laughs> Four Spartan blades, their last two, the Talos and the Aster. Aster weren't quite this big, which I wasn't really as fond of as this one. This one kind of rivals the size of the Alala, which I like a lot, and I like the design of it. So, you know, why not? 
Why not? That's what I say. Why not? That's where I'm at nowadays with knives. Why not? Let's give me that one. That's great. Can't argue why I don't need it. All right. All right, checking out the Vostied Raccoon with Crossbar neck. So I think we gave a raccoon away a while ago, though I believe it was the button lock version. I remember really liking that knife, but we weren't able to stock any at the time. Wah, wah, wah. All right, we did. I remember that. Yep, go ahead. All right, so now we've got the Crossbar lock version. Yes. Along with the Nightshade, Corsair, Corgi, and soon, the Vostied Mayhem. Can't wait for that one either. So... The new version of the raccoon comes in eight different colors. There's black, brown, green, orange, white, and yellow. Some are even available in different finishes. When open at 7.6 inch overall, the 14 seat, 28 in, drop point blade is 3.25 inch. Don't call me Chester. Okay. 0.125 in thickness, flat grind, plain edge, and comes to about 58 to 62 on the HRC scale. I think I did it to myself. We're so distracted. I'm getting ready to say, ah, you twist to simulate kindling. He Finishes vary from satin to stone wash Yay. to black stone wash this and back to satin. Not back to satin. Handle is Micarta, offered in black, green, brown, but also comes in a yellow, orange, or white G10. So blade can be opened with either the dual-sided thumb studs or the crossbar lock. There you go. Blade glides on cage ceramic ball bearing pivot system designed by you. Not you, but Y-U-E. This folder has a lanyard hole. Yay! Reversible stainless tip-up pocket clip. And comes with patch, cleaning cloth, sticker, pouch, and tin. Become one smooth bandit. I see there what you did there. With the Vosteed Raccoon. Just $59. From Atlantknife.com. So, I like the raccoon. You're going to go first. Sure. You want me to, don't you? Yeah. Go ahead. A raccoon's a nice little knife. I mean... I like the, uh, what is the lock called? Crossbar. Crossbar lock. I was thinking XT. at somebody else. Um, very responsive. Ooh, your fingerprint's there, too. Sorry. So, wow. That is pretty responsive. I like that. I like how it sets in the palm of my hand, too. That's very nice. I would feel very comfortable using this knife. Good Flip. jimping on top. I would give it a solid A. Flip it good. Dun, 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 dun. Okay, well... I think this is a knockout. The crossbar is having its heyday, and Vossi isn't wasting time getting on the action. This is probably their third most popular knife, right after the Thunderbird and the Nightshade. I really like this design. It fits the hand really well, cuts like nobody's business, because the shape's easy to sharpen, and all the cool options make it a must-have. So I, too, am giving it a... Tin and pouch are back. Was it an easy A? But for how long mm. is my question? Broken record, just Joel. And like that, we're on to the Kaiser Justice 2. So, it's the I week of to. remakes here on AK. I know, I know, I know. As Kaiser has remodeled an old favorite. The Kaiser Justice, now the Justice 2, is in fixed blade form. Yeah, only one option. It's 8.83 inches overall with a 4.59 inch D2 drop point blade with stonewash finish, plain edge, Flat grind, 0.18 inch thickness, and jimping. Handle is Makarta spliced with G10. Comes with a black Kydex belt sheath. Yay! Snap. There it is. And weighs just 6.11 ounces. Wow. Okay. Designed by Azo and a nut. This fixed blade has a lanyard hole. Yep. Removable glass breaker. Is it really yes. removable? Yes. Oh, wow. And it's only $59 from Atlantic Knife. Now, how you remove dot it com. is another, another question. Well, let's not worry about that. Another right issue now. for another day. All right. All right. So I think the splicing of Macarta and G10 is great. Definitely wasn't spliced like Dren. Much more positive results. But I'm not sure why they did this. I feel like it was just to make it thicker, I guess. They didn't want to put a really thick piece of Macarta. I don't know. But it looks and feels great. I mean, I do think that they made the handle more curved outwards. I guess, instead of being flat like the, the folding justice. You mean contoured? Yeah. Convex. Contour. That's what I was, I was looking for. Instead that of word. concave. Yeah. So it makes it more comfortable to hold. I think it's a good knife. Good size. A. Mm, just A. 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 Yeah. A. A. All right. All right. What do you think, C? Well, when it comes to fixed blades, there are lots of options. Just like folding knives, of course. Uh, but I think I'm more picky and, and um, what's that? Was the word picky? I'm more 
discerning? Yeah, I think so. Like, I like this knife. Yeah. It kind of reminds me of one of my favorite knives, the old hen and rooster with the blue scales on it we had, oh, seven, eight years ago. But I prefer, like, I like this knife here, too. About the blue I like a bulky right handle, or I like a Sasbo type handle. Sasbo. I don't like a leather stacked or, you know, anything like that, like rubber handle or most of the uh, the SOG knives, fixed blades, I'm not really into those either. But this one, I really think I could use this knife and like to use it. It has a very thick steel, which is very nice when I start beating it to death, which will happen. And I'm intrigued by how to take this off on the end. Yeah, I figure that I out. Yeah, I think there's like a day. little tool. It probably just pinches it or not something. Not a big fan of uh, Kydex sheath, but we're also talking $59. That's true. You get wow. a sheath. That's that's the big thing is that $59, you normally wouldn't think you'd get in a sheath, but you're getting a sheath. So. There you go. Exactly. All right, so go ahead. You want me to go ahead? Mm hmm. Why do I have to go ahead? Because. All right, we've, we've come to the final knife. Here it is. Look back and first. QSP Penguin Plus. What? New options, especially in Nebula carbon fiber. Yeah. I try to do it. Why don't you get is. him to do it? I should. And I should. slide it in. I should. I'll get him to do it, it for you. All right. So, 14. He does it way better than I do. So, 14 different options to pick from. Love these. So, it's 7.875 inches overall with a 3.375 inch CPM 20 CV sheep's foot blade with jimping, plain edge, and flat grind. So, Finishes come in either the satin, this one has like a, a black stone wash, I'm guessing. And then, the best part, blade is deployed with jimp back flipper tank. Can't be dead. Handle comes in carbon fiber or titanium, so even have both, like this one. Look, Look at, at that. that. Both of them, same knife. Nebula carbon fiber front. Party in the front. Black titanium. Business in the back. Yeah, would you stop doing that? I can't help it. I've avoided doing it. Well. All right. Nope, no. That's boy. getting edited. <laughs> Finally, each frame lock has a tip up deep carry reversible wired pocket clip, lanyard hole, and starts at only $175.95 from AtlanticKnife.com. And there it is. Do your thing. Okay, well, I really like these models, if you couldn't tell. Now, I was going to get this one instead of the QSP Greeby button lock we did last week, but two things are giving me a little bit of hesitation. So, one, not full carbon fiber one side presentation side could have done on the back and this one's kind of a biggie really qsp a wired pocket clip on this you could have slapped a titanium clip on there at this quality at this level there should be no wired pocket clips yes that type of clip works yes it's easily reversible but you need to put in a little bit of extra time and money to upgrade everything not just the handle and the steel i'm sorry i'm picky that's just the way it is now other than that, I love the options. The Penguin is easily my favorite model from QSP. And I think other than the two things I mentioned, this is a perfect choice for. And everybody else. A. Said my F. Piece. No F. I'm kidding. A. Not Crocker. Crocker, yeah. No. Yeah. See, so go ahead. Your turn. All right. Please don't say anything. I'm getting a little tired of the Penguin. <laughs> I like it in XL. La, 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 I would have took it in XL from the you. very beginning. Can't hear you. First thing I said, and we got this thing. That's a nice knife. I really like it a lot. We're going to sell a ton of these. Man, I wish it was bigger. Um, now you're complaining because you what you wanted. Now, several millennia have passed. <laughs> several millennia. Yeah, I'm not even sure that uh, I can remember the original Penguin anymore. I can. Blue denim Macarta, said and finished. I like it a lot. I like the uh, upgrade to the steel 20 CV. And just look at that. Look I at that know. blade. I saw I that love blade show and I'm like, that is so nice. Perfect grind. I mean, yeah, I guess I'd have to get one, but you know, I, if I liked it at 30, I love it at 170. God. Damn, drop that but one. You got it, you got the quality, you got the carbon fiber, you got the titanium, you got the 20 C V. You got it mm -hmm. bigger. I mean, jeez. You want me to just hand it to you for free? I'm not gonna do that. Come on. The business, I gotta make money too. All right, well, you guys know the drill. That was our final knife for this week. But don't rush off. Make sure to like, share, comment, and subscribe to enter to win the formidable Fix Blade giveaway. You'll regret it if you don't, okay? So mm. just right here on this video, or you can become an official AK member with the link down below. It's one decision you'll be glad you made. Yep. We're also on the social media sites like Facebook, Pinterest, Reddit, YouTube, Instagram, Rumble, and AK's blog. 
That's cool. What do you, what do you I doing? don't know. I just made it. There up. is a circle. We post videos, pictures, and AK deal updates all the time. So check us out. Every single day. All right. So favorite knife time. I am going to change things up and I am going to go first. All right. Do it. So it was going to be the QSP. Yes. But the carbon fiber on the back and the wire pocket clip have kind of made it a tie. So I think I'm going to have to go with the raccoon. But you could do a gang symbol. Penguin for life. Because <laughs> they brought the pouch and the pin back. I'm going raccoon. And I really like the raccoon. Yeah. Wow, that's crazy. I know. It is crazy, but it's just... Look at that. Because the raccoon isn't even my first favorite wow. bow steed on the table. Wow. Does that mean you're going corgi? I'm thinking about it. I might want to give Kershaw their props, too. He said he really liked this before we started doing it. And I said, no, you didn't. You didn't just say you liked yeah. a Kershaw. And he was like, yeah, I you like think I'd do it? Yeah, go ahead. I think go ahead. I'd do it. I think you, it's time. You had me thinking a few minutes ago. You said, what do you want to do, give to you for free? I have not tried yet to, to email one of them and say, look, I won't be placing my next order unless it comes with a free penguin. I've never thought about that. I don't know if the boss will be able to let you put that contingency on order. Well, he's not right? over my shoulder. He's not there. Okay. I'd be what like, look, heck? You got Chinese on video people won't send me their knives. I don't know what's going on, man. All right, I'm going to go with this one. You're going with there the Kershaw Launch 8, the yep. new one. Wow. I did not see that coming. In future episodes, I regret that I did that. Probably. All right. Just like a, what's that girl? Give them to him, Porky. What does that mean? You're oh, supposed that's to say all, that's folks. all, folks. I got you. With that, I'm seeing this is... Jewel. Just Jewel. Three J's. And we're signing off. No end then. Alright, I'm doing a sound a raccoon makes. Yeah. Oh, I don't know. Got you to make a raccoon sound. That's great. When opened at 7.6 inch overall. You got that from uh What? <laughs> um Jim uh, Ackroyd and Can Candy, uh Great Outdoors. Of course the other perks to becoming an AK. It's not today, is it? Craggy. <laughs>